we doing everybody welcome back today we are going to be highlighting the Farah as a primary ar on rebirth island and i'm going to put it straight for you guys this thing absolutely shreds way more than i ever thought it would i used to hate this gun so many people in my twitch chat have been requesting me to give it a shot to use it Finally, I threw it in my loadout, and boy, was I pleasantly surprised because we were absolutely dominating the island. Now, as per usual, we're gonna go ahead and get into the loadout first, just so you have an idea of what I'm gonna be rocking in the gameplay. Then, we'll go ahead and flip over to the action. We got a one gameplay for you guys today, but it is an absolute banger with this gun. Hope you enjoyed today's video. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go through the build that we're gonna be rocking on the far in this gameplay. What I will say is, this is a pretty standard, but let's go ahead and get into it. Now, kicking it off, we're gonna be rocking the Gru Suppressor for the muzzle slot. This is your equivalent to the Agency Suppressor for most of the other primary Cold War ARs. So this one's pretty simple. Bullet velocity, effective damage range are two of the key ones. Then obviously we get some of that sound suppression, and it also adds the vertical recoil control, which is super important for the far. Now, next up, for the barrel, we're gonna be rocking the Spetsnaz RPK, the very last one on the list. This is your equivalent to the Task Force of Bale for the other Cold War ARs that you're probably used to. It does the exact same thing. So bullet velocity, effective damage range, which is obviously key since we're gonna be using this thing from long range. And it also gives you the horizontal and vertical recoil control, which again is super important for this gun. Now next up for the optic, I'm gonna be rocking the Axial Arms 3X. This is my personal favorite. You can rock the 4X if you really prefer that. I think most people prefer the 3X at this point. And for the reticule, I personally prefer to run the precision reticule. As most of you guys know, this is the fourth one over, but but as I always say, it's really just up to personal preference. Give some of these a go and see which one you like best. Now, next up for the underbarrel, we're gonna be rocking the Spetsnaz grip. This is your equivalent to the field agent grip that you'd be rocking on some of the other Cold War ARs. It does the exact same thing, horizontal and vertical recoil control, which as I keep saying, is super important for the far because this thing does has a decent amount of recoil and it has some aiming stability issues. So the Spetsnaz grip is a very important attachment. Now, of course, last but not least, we gotta slap a magazine on this thing. I chose to go with the 45 rounder over the 60 60 round magazine simply for the aim down sight time that it gives you over the 60 round mag for some reason like i said in the past i never really used to like the farah and i think it was because i was rocking a 60 round over a 45 round on it kind of similar to the em2 the 60 round just does not feel right for me the 45 rounder made this gun so much more bearable so i highly recommend rocking the 45 rounder the far has got a lot of damage so i really don't think the extra 15 rounds is worth losing that mobility and overall the gun just feels so much better with the 45 rounder so that's why i highly recommend that all right i'm about to go vibe out at bio i think all right boys let's go get ourselves a 20. we've been so close especially early stream man we could do this today Easy. We can get this far gameplay. This thing's been feeling real nice to me. That's one. That's one. Uh, modern nat types means you're connect. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think nat types a little different. Cause they had, they used to have nat type back in like Modern Warfare 2. Cause I remember like that was like a big thing. Dude, what the? Oh, nice little bank shot, baby. Little bank shot on that guy. GG's. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Is Nat type? I remember when I used to play Modern Warfare 2. Like, Nat type was like such a big discussion between who could host or whatnot. GG's. I ain't letting you guys get this loady. Nope. Nope. Not today, mother. Not today. We ain't playing that shit. LC10 OTS. LC10 is not bad. I'm trying. I'm trying to get a gameplay with the far right now. I've been enjoying it today, man. Oh, I gotta get out of here, dude. I might be dead. No, dude, why did you land? You're dead. Why would you land over here? You, you realize you're dead. I, weekdays, I do 7 p.m. Eastern time, and on weekends, I usually do uh, in the morning, like 9. All right, quick 10. A quick little 10 bomb, I'll take it. Enemy 
this tech over here? Okay. I'll separate from tech a little bit. I'll give him space. I'll give him some space. He's got a full team over there in that building, though. Ah, I see a full three rat team. Yeah, I'm just going to deady on him, honestly. I don't even care. Yeah, you sending it? Oh! Oh, Lord! Too easy, baby. Rats exterminated. Too freaking easy, baby. Oh, I know we want to be nerd. We've been, we've been dominating actually all freaking day. To be honest with you, we just had a couple. We just had a couple games where I was just more focused on the people showing love, and that's okay. But when, when we play some legit games, we're killing it. Got a full team from security pulling up. Uh oh. Get me involved with this baby. Oh my god, definitely. Chupai people, nyanyo. Ah, this lobby's kind of dying out. No sir. No, sir. No, sir. We ain't doing that. Favorite AR. Oh, my favorite AR is the XM4, but I'm not going to lie, dude. I am really enjoying the FAR today. Like, the FAR has been hitting today. I'm not gonna lie, bro. You should have had me right there. I'm lost. I am lost. I don't know what's going on right now. Oh! What the hell? No AR ammo? No one's got any AR ammo right now. Bro, I am going to be honest with you. I am not trying to get you. I am going to be honest. I am not trying to get you right now. No way. Call this real quick. What we got here? Most of the most of the lobby's down here, man. I don't like that at all. Beach ain't good. The far is hitting nicely, dude. I'm telling you. I, I hated this gun like two weeks ago. But she is shredding for me today. I don't know what it is. I got flying. He is. Oh, no. No! All right, boys. We got a little nice little 20 brewing here. No. Tech died. Damn. GG's. Oh! RPG boy. Guy on top of my building, by the way, Tech. He just climbed the ladder. Sounds good. <sighs> Probably a bunch of people. I think someone just landed on him. They did. Yes, sir. Thank you for the distraction, baby. Thank you for the distraction, There's baby. Like out to our I think someone's at the buy station. I just heard. Oh, yeah, he's pushing blue. Oh, no. Coming in from Nova too. Mm. There's two over there by that far blue building. I think there's a guy. There's the other teams of security somewhere too. I remember them being down there. Nice. Now another one coming in front door right here. I'm backing up. I don't got blades. Yep. What? I don't know where this other team's at. 
Oh, okay. I got some plates for you if you want them. Yeah, and then the next building over. What is this clown doing? He just died in the gas. <laughs> Good stuff, baby. Let's go. GG's. Nice. A little 44 between us. Nice. Oh nice. Let's go, baby. GG's. Oh.